right tackle, now your left tackle. What's the, is that any difference at all? Uh, no, not really. Spring allowed me to really switch positions, but that's what I played in high school. So going back to that is just kind of like riding a bike again, just getting used to playing on the other side, but nothing really changes that much. There's obviously a reputation there with protecting the blind side. How have you, have you processed that in your mind, the responsibility there? Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't let it get to my head too much. You're still, I mean, at right tackle, if you don't protect the quarterback, he's going to get hit. So same thing. It's, I guess some people look at it as more pressure, but if you do your job, there's no much more pressure there. When, when did you did you kind of assume you would be at left coming into this year? Uh, I was just ready to play either way, and uh, Coach Norcross before spring ball uh, made the move, had me move over, so I was I was ready to play either one, whatever he needed me at. Holden and Gallagher were some of the leaders on this on this uh, offensive line. Are you ready to step up and kind of be a leader and showing some of the younger guys uh, like Cochran coming in, kind of throwing the ropes a little bit? Yes, yeah. Will and uh, Duger were definitely great role models, especially and Andrew Jelks as well. Uh, for me, when I was a younger guy uh, coming into the role of playing and stuff, so I've really helped. I've worked with Devin and some of even the freshmen just on technique and trying to understand the playbook because. You never know who's going to get called on, whether it's Devin or even a uh, true freshman like that. So I've really tried to help them understand and let them know any questions or anything they need, they can come to me. What you took a really big step up in the last two games last season. Uh, what did you see in your fellow teammates that really made that difference? Uh, I think everyone was just came ready to play every week. Um, everyone really wanted it, and we knew what we had to do to get it done. And everyone, it, everything kind of started to click offensively, special teams and defense, everything really came together and everyone got to see what happens when we play. Well, and are you seeing that through this fall and summer? Yes, yeah, so we were having, I think, great summer and then camp. We offense have shown a lot of production and stuff and really clicking the best since I've been here. So it's great, very excited to see what we have this fall. What are you better at now than maybe you weren't that first game when you had to go out there as a young guy? Uh, I guess understanding the offense. Uh, first going out there as a true freshman and stuff, you kind of just Make sure your guy doesn't tackle the running back or quarterback. And so now fully understanding the offense. And I guess full, Coach Norcross has really helped me understand not just like a defensive front, but understanding the whole defense and why we're doing certain things we are. And being able to see different things has also helped me mentally with the game. So it's not still an individualistic thing that I just have to block my guy and that's all I have to worry well, about? Well, no, it's not. You're not so far. Obviously, you still have to just make sure your guy doesn't make the play. But Nor Coach Norcross has done a great job with the whole offensive line. It's making us understand why we're doing things, understand why the defense moves the way they do to help in protection, because if we move in unison, that's when big things can happen. Does that help more pre-snap then, if they're, if you have to make an adjustment or trying to figure out this is why Kyle is changing the protection, that sort of thing? Exactly, yeah, it does help um, working like that with pre-snap and stuff, but even post-snap, why, how guys are gonna move once the ball is snapped and that kind of thing. Thanks, Justin. You're Appreciate it. Oh, uh, you're blocking for running backs with a lot of different styles. Do you kind of change how you block based on who's carrying the ball? Uh, no, not really. I mean, whoever's back there, we're going to block hard and just let them get free and hopefully celebrate with them in the end zone. Thank you. Justin, how is the um, the rigor of the preseason practice? I mean, I know a lot of offensive linemen and, and defensive linemen lose body mass during these times. How is that going for the offensive line in general and your, or yourself? Uh, I think everyone's doing a great job. I mean, our strength staff and uh, training staff does a great job, like weighing us before and after practice and making sure we eat and get the right fluids in us. So I don't, no one's really had a problem with that this camp, and everyone's been doing a great job keeping their weight up and everything like that. Okay. Great.